Hey guys, Marvin here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do your own write signature integration via Globiflow. So, here's the link of the blog that Globiflow just published a few days ago about the um, write signature integration. Um, I'm going to paste this link as well on the description in the Real Automations community page but um, to go ahead first thing that you want to do of course is log into your Podio, Globiflow and write signature and then once you do that um, you go to your account just click on this link and then scroll down to the integrations you will see um, Citrix share file and write signature um, I've already um, connected mine but if it's your first time doing it you will see these things um, right signature just click on connect and then you will be redirected to the right signature um, page to grant and it will ask you to grant access for the Globiflow for Podio just grant access and you should be good to go so now we go to our Podio and we go to our offers app we have to make um, two changes here so we need to modify our template first thing that we would want to do is to add an option to the generate slash send contract category field which is send via write signature alright and the second thing is we would like to add a category field which is um, write signature status and we only have one option which is signed right once you've done that just click on done to save your changes there you go and then now we go to our Globy flow click on my flows to view your um, work organization tree and then let's go to our offers app here we are going to add two flows first flow is item updated send via write signature so we would want to check if the user had made changes on this field which is the generate slash send contract category field and we would see if the changes is um, send via write signature if they um, choose the send via write signature so first um, filter which is this one um, generate slash contract values change and the second one is this one field value match so if generate slash send contract field equal to send via right signature meaning if they click on this one um, we will do the following actions so we would want to have this guy right here this is this guy so we would want to collect all the most recent PDF and then we would send an email with the right signature link to the email address that we indicate here so to seller name which is this one just seller contact let me show this to you here and then seller email address which is the offers field seller email basically the two name is the name of seller contract which is um, real automation test and the email address email seller email is this one seller email field that's in offers app all right then the subject is purchase contract for seller to contact which is the same the name of the seller contact which is real automation test and then we would save that next flow we are going to do is this one file signed by a right signature if um, you do it the first time you would like to add new new flow and then write signature document sign so once you click on that you will be redirected to this page and then simple things um, this flow only captures that um, the email that you signed it that, that you send the contract to has already signed the contract so Globiflow 
would want to update the item so we would want to change the right signature status field that we just added this one to signed so update this offer which is this flow yeah update item right signature status value is signed and then we would want to add a comment to the item just to remind us that the document has been signed on the time so seller contact to which is the seller contact and then has signed the contract at current date and time if you scroll down here this is the field current date underscore current underscore date underscore time all right and we would want to save the flow of course yep so let's test this out I've already generated a contract um, by clicking this generate PDF you know you already have that if you're a real automation client and right now I'm going to do is I'm going to click this send via right signature I've indicated my own email address here so um, I'll be receiving an email here right there All right so if your customer is marvin.podiohub.com you will receive an email to review the document and sign document and write signature All right. so let's sign the document Oops. and then I will submit my signature once your customer has signed the document or once your seller signed the document you will this um, item will be updated right signature there you go right signature status field has been set to signed and there's the comment real automation test has signed the contract at 2015-07-23 now um, the contract attached here is still the old contract meaning it's not yet signed but in the future um, Andreas from Globiflow is going to um, include the automation to bring back the signed document going to this item but if you visit your um, right signature account dashboard um, you will see that there is a contract already signed um, by your um, seller which is this one purchase contract for real automation test all right so that's it guys i'm going to post this video in the real automations community page if you have questions just put comments there and i'll find best time to answer your questions thanks